And you've got to ask yourself, what does a lavender bush and an emu have in common? What does a full-grown African ostrich have in common with a lavender bush? What does a black cockatoo and a lavender bush have in common? What does a kangaroo and a lavender bush have in common? What does a bunch of goats and a lavender bush have in common? What does a bush wall be and a lavender bush got in common? What does a peacock and a lavender bush have in common? The thing is, none of these things have anything to do with lavender plants. So the thing I'm about to show you has something to do with lavender plant. Once I get it clear. So what actually has something in common with this lavender plant is this, which is a daisy bush. Um, the daisy bush and the lavender plants, both when their flowers die, is the time you hedge them and you hedge them hard. So we're going to do that today. Now I was going to use hand hedges, so it's like more like what a gardener would use, but uh, winter bunnings and this one. If I'm going to be honest, I'm not going to spend more than eight bucks on hand hedges when I've got an actual petrol one. So we're going to smash that petrol one out right now. Here it is. So with this uh, daisy bush, we're trying to do two things. We're trying to separate this one so it stops getting killed by the daisy bush growing over it. We're also trying to keep its kind of weird circular shape. It's not really a circle, but it, it does the job. I said circle, but I uh, um, meant square, <laughs> so it's square, and we've taken all the bulbs off, so that will all grow back nicely, and we've separated the little little bush away from the other one. Now it's the, uh, the lavender's turn. <laughs> So you'll be all like, that's the worst shaping I've ever seen in my life. Um, that's pretty cool. That's a fair call because it's my garden and I kind of like my garden looking a bit, you know, gardeny instead of like this straight bloody bracket stuff. So it needs to look a little bit, you know, rustic and a bit, a bit weird over here, over there. Kind of like, you know, but here's, here's me doing a straight one. enjoyed the first episode of uh, Yak's Garden and um, like and subscribe all that sort of jazz see you next time <laughs>